Hi everyone! I'm glad you're alright. <sighs> Can't talk about anything. We love you. Shock up. <clears throat> I just got like some mad headache, man. <sighs> it's horrible. Just call, call them all work. Take these my grand tablets. Oh, it's getting worried. Huey, hello Huey. Oh my lord. Scariest day ever, man. Is the necklace broken? No, it's alright, isn't it? I think it's just on wrong, that's why. Are you okay? Yeah, like It's even worse, man. It's just everything is just bad, bad guys. Thank you for the gifts. Send in hugs. Thank you, uh, Claire, darling. No one cares, darling. That's all right. <clears throat> Hello, Claire, darling. Hi, Jay, darling. See, I was losing the plot because of everything and just drank, went to Bermondsey and drank and don't know what happened. 
And that's because I am bipolar. And I don't know what I'm doing, so... It's fucking dangerous, man. That's why I always say on here, man, you don't realise, man, I'm not fucking... I'm bipolar, man. I've got fucking... A chemical imbalance. That's why I respect Islam a lot, because they know it's bad for you, isn't it? But it is what it is, I'm just learning new stuff. Obviously when I'm drunk, I don't know what I'm saying, so... Uh, it is what it is, but... Police are not nice, man. I, I don't know, man, it's horrible. But it's alright, man. I've had worse. I think I'm misunderstood more than anything. I just need a bit of help and support, that's all it is. Not fucking minute, every second they have a fucking malicious call. Doing it to me on holiday. Fucking everywhere I go, man. Like, it's all right them investigating the accusations against me. What about all the accusations that I'm telling them about what's happening to me? They couldn't give a shit. But it is what it is. Like, they even do it to Marcus Ems, don't they? It's just how it is, isn't it? But, as far as I'm concerned, the amount of stress that I've been going through and the fact that they've boot de booted down my door, they keep coming out to me, it's, it's causing me and my mental health a lot of uh, stress and it led me to intoxicate myself and go crazy and start screaming and shouting. Lulu, thank you. Thank you, Huey. There's so many people that come on this app and say the worst things. I don't ever see no one do nothing to these people. But... I see that I'm someone that's a target because I'm a good TikToker, because I make a lot of money, because I'm entertaining, whether I'm crazy or not. People do love me and people do like me. You know, you can all sit there and say this and that, but you will never know what it's like to be sat here in this chair and be me because you're not me. And you, you've not gone through my life. You haven't been through. You haven't lived my life. So you don't know about my fucking traumas. Because I don't have a book out there yet. But there will be soon. <clears throat> and it's trauma that leads to mental health and all these things it's a simple fact stop drinking yeah yeah but when you're going through this what i'm going through 2 a.m in the morning i can't get in my house three days in a hotel natalie even had to come and help me do the door 
then they're out again. Then they keep coming out. It calmed down. Now it's going crazy again. <clears throat> no, but if my life was all right, for instance, if I'm in my place, my address hasn't been leaked, police are not coming here, I'd be a different person. But because I do suffer with my mental health and I am bipolar, there's only so much. And then I'm lucky I've even not even gone fucking nuts, even crazier. I don't know. Because that's what happens. Tyron got a ban for even showing your videos. This is the thing, guys. When you're bipolar, you can't drink. But I'm not thinking that am I when I'm stressed and I'm upset and I feel like I'm having a breakdown. No. What do I do? Start drinking. You can't say just don't drink when you're feeling so low in yourself. Go and tell all the rest of that are fucking drink people that are fucking are losing it in life. Go and tell them not to drink as well. I'd like to say it is my fault. It's my fault that I drank. But why, why, why is it my fault? Why, why is it your fault, Chelsea? Why is it your fault? I need to know, when you were going through severe trolling, what you've gone through for more or less two years, anyone else would go cuckoo. Even people that don't suffer with mental health would have gone through some real mental health shit. And it's as simple as that. It's like people that are Tourette's. They say the worst thing. What are you going to do? You're going to start slagging them off, saying they're this, they're that, they're, look what they're doing, they're, They've got a mental health condition, the Tourette's, they, they, they can't help it. So there's certain things that you can't help or you can't stop because you're unaware. It's not, it's like if I'm sat here and I'm slagging off these people, that people, da, 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 then I know what I'm saying. But if you're intoxicated, where you don't even know where the fuck you are, you don't know where you are, that you don't know what you're saying, you know, and I'm someone that comes on my social media platform and I express to you how bad it is for me to drink, the stupid things that I've said when I've drank, you know, this, that. I, I'm, I'm not aware. It's like you blank out. You have a bipolar blank out. You totally blank. It's, it's, that's what's dangerous because you don't know. Now, for me, yeah, alcohol is dangerous so that's why you don't really see me going out partying doing all these things because if i could handle alcohol i'd probably be out all the time going clubbing doing this but i know it doesn't work for me i never used to i, I could never i've never been able to see myself do you understand it's mad It's just like you've got a partner and you're going through bare shit or whatever or your husband pisses you off or does something. You might say the worst things to him. But deep down inside, you don't mean it, do you? You're just so angry at that time. The difference between me and you guys is I've, I'm a live streamer. And when I do get so stressed that I've intoxicated myself and I don't even know I'm still alive. That's the difference. There's people, they wouldn't show that side. 
you don't see the whole sides of everything. You only see one side. <clears throat> you can't tell me like nothing. I listen to doctors, thanks. I'll listen to my doctor over any of you all day long. When my doctor's telling me, you can't drink, it's this, it's that. But you start thinking, oh yeah, I'll just have a little something, it's fine. I'm all right on this, I'm not losing it. I'm still like aware of whatever, you know. It's the worst thing. I see the amount of hate, the amount of hate to be so successful. Expect to be hated on more than fucking anyone on the fucking whole app. Because I'm very powerful. I'm very intelligent. A lot of people say to me, you know what, Chelsea, you're actually fucking so intelligent. And it's, it's, it's you know, you're special, you're creative. You, you've got something about you. You're an idol. You're this, you're that. You're just different. Don't forever sit here and think da da da. I already know that I'm special. I have to tell myself that day every single day. I don't wait for you guys to come on here and go, oh, Chelsea, you're special. I already know I'm special. That's why I've got you all watching me. If I wasn't special, I'd be like, what? 10 people watching me? Popular number four. Tell me I'm not a popular bitch. If I was such a bad person and this and that, no one would even watch me. I'd be cancelled from ages ago. Thank you, John, darling. Yeah, people love causing me in my life misery. They love it calling up, saying this, saying that, getting my door smashed off, trying to get me arrested, trying to get me kicked out of places, calling up, saying this. Do you think that's normal? But I don't act like, I just act like, oh, whatever. But deep down inside, you don't understand how that makes me feel. Because none of you are fucking asked me. You too busy. Oh, look what's happened with this. Look what... You don't care about my mental health. You couldn't care less. You just want entertainment. All right, you tell me how it's my fault then. You tell me how this is my fault. So it's my fault that I never got in my house. It's my fault that the trolls are trolling me. It's all my fault. I tell you what, you put your fucking, you put your shoes in my shoes and you tell me how you'll handle it. And make sure to do it for two years, bitch, with everything that I've gone through. And tell me if you're even still sat in this yard, you would have been gone after a fucking week, sweetheart. You wanna sat here, darling? Billions and fucking, billions of views on social media. You tell me how it would be like if I, le you know, if, darling, if someone leaks your address, it could be any of you. If someone does that, that is the worst thing to ever have done. It's called doxing. It's totally unacceptable. Are you forgetting I have people making accounts with my address, with this coming in, gifting me, da da da, da anything. People say my dress just 
whatever. I don't need to sit here and lie. If, I'm, if I've done something wrong, I've done something wrong. Yeah, I said some terrible things and I put my hands up. I was intoxicated. I would have never said it if I wasn't intoxicated. I didn't know what I was saying at the time when I was saying it. And I was intoxicated. I didn't even know what the fuck I was, darling. But I will be coming out of here. Because my safety does matter. You know, my life does matter. Now imagine, like, if the camera's on you every day when you're having an episode and you're not even, you don't even have bipolar or whatever. You all sit there like you've never done nothing wrong in your whole life, like you're all fucking Adam and Eve, like you're the perfectest, never smoked, never drank, never done this, never done that, never told anyone to F off, never done this, never said anyone, duh, duh. never said nothing, because you're all so perfect. I need to be like you lot. Pumpkin, thank you. I ain't even got your number, Burris. I'll speak to you, Burris. Send me your number on this account. This one. I don't even have your number. I'll speak to you private. John C, thank you. Burris, if I told you, like, basically, when I say they messed up the door, fucking hell, sweetheart, everything now is just crazy. That, I don't know, man. Oh, well, it is what it is. I just want to do good, man. All this anger inside that I have to get rid of, man. And I know I've sat here and said, I need to do this, I need to do that. But at the same time, you still don't understand how famous I am, you know? You don't realise that I can't actually walk the streets without people. Everyone knows me. I go to the fucking airport. Everyone knows me. I you know, I could go and move into another place, for instance, and the whole block's probably going to know who I am. So it's a bit more difficult for someone like me that's so famous, darling. I wish I was an absolute nobody and then I could be like half of these other TikTokers and never get trolled, go live, go on holiday. Dude, no one cares because no one knows you. You're a nobody. You might make money, whatever, but no one knows you on the fame of me. You do not have billions of views. You have not hit this internet up like me. These fuckers you've seen them probably once on the FYP. How many times have I been on the FYP for like fucking every day for four years, more or less? Get out of here. I do deserve that crown. Oh... Yeah, I see how horrible the life is. We already live in a horrible world as it is. It's not the best, is it? Do you know what I mean? So it's nice if we're all being more nicer to each other. Um, Mr. Blue Sky, thank you. Thank you, Claire. Thank you to all my new subscribers. Oh, darling, we'll have you all subscribing. Austin, thank you. Lisa Johnson, I'm going to talk to you. Let me just follow you all back. So I've got you, John Scott, in case you need to message me. John C, Lisa, Diamond, Bex, Tom, Jody, Danny, Just Kelly. Sammy Jane, Sasha B, 
Ollie Clark, Lauren, Ruby. I oh, listen, I'm not doing this all night. <laughs> Next one, <laughs> just you know, darling. The real GC, thank you, yo. Guys, thank you, darling. Joran, Jora, thank you, Jora. I appreciate all the subscriptions. I'll give you all a follow back. Oh, guys, if I could have some neck explain. Mitch, thank you for joining. Oh, everyone's subscribing. Look, let me get you. Oh, gosh, guys, I'm getting gifts. I'm getting this. I don't know what to do. Famous, darling. Must be because people hate me so much. Um, right. Linda, Melissa, Emma, Jora, Yo, The Real GC, Johnny Lego, Susan, Austin, Lisa, yeah. They enable you. Thank you, Matt. Now, I used to be such a different person. I never even used to really scream, to be honest. If anything, I used to cry. But then I think... You know when you've had so much abuse in your life that it's just, you just, you go crazy after a while. That's it. And there's nothing you can do. Because you're damaged. Damaged goods. You know, I think this is why I have this passion so much to help the youngsters, like, in the system and in this and in that. Even today, man. You know, you're in a cell, four walls. You don't even have a fucking magazine, nothing to look at, to read, to, you know, and your thoughts are just going like that. They do it on purpose. They make you go crazy. But I had to grab myself and get myself together because I was just, like, crying so much, I couldn't breathe. And then it just flashed in my face. And I thought, you fucking bitch, don't cry. You've got 10-year-old kids locked up like this that have got mental health and they've got nothing to look at. And when I said that I had an invention or what I wanted to do, or what, what, you know, I wanted to try and bring out into the system for these kind of youngsters or people that do deal with mental health and they can't help it and they'll just start smashing up the place, <laughs> banging their heads, doing whatever, you know, because they're literally, they can't cope. And there's nothing put into place and all they would probably do is inject them or dose them up and mong them out. There's no... This world's pretty scary, I'm saying. There's, there's, you know, it's... You know, any, any, any child, anyone that's got mental health is stemmed from trauma somewhere, something that they've gone through they haven't been able to deal with and it's causing them so much... Whatever. There's women that, you, that have gone through domestic violence fucking for 50 years 40 years whatever and they're broken you know and for them to get back you know it's that's not an easy thing to do because you lose yourself you don't know who you are anymore it's like you've been overtaken you know it's <clears throat> Thank you. 
But yeah, mental health is, you know, like I, I go to Spain, no one deals with mental health. Everyone's fine. You know, there's a lot of countries they don't, you know, I think even in India, they don't, um, they don't deal, they don't have mental health. It's non-existent. So it just goes to show you. But in this country, we have a lot of mental health to deal with. Um, you know, it's actually it's crazy. Juggling Jane, thank you. But I know that sitting here, you like, like my life is is. The situation's not getting better. Thank you, Juggling Jane. I've got to that point where I'm famous now. Everyone knows who I am. TikTok's a massive platform. Everyone knows about it. Maybe there's a few people that doesn't. I, I get it. How am I getting a warning? <sighs> I'm drinking Coca-Cola, man. It's crazy, isn't it? And then that's just made me forget what I'm saying. Yeah, but all right, this is what I'm saying to you. I could be so much of a better TikToker and better at everything if I wasn't going through the trolling that I'm going through. My address being leaked, this, that, malicious calls, da, 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 da. It's, it's nonstop. Now, how do you live a normal life and I don't get benefits no more or anything, you know? I'm about to start my businesses. I'm about to do this. I've spent a lot of money into my business. I'm about to do this. I'm about to do that. You understand? This is my job. It's all right for people to tell me, don't live stream then. Don't live stream when it's my job. This is what's changed me. You know... I make more money than half of the fucking police put together, sweetheart. You know, and things like that. They should go and leave their job then, innit? Being as though you don't do that great. You know, it's just... Everything's just... So when you've got all this anger, because it's just too much. Don't ever sit there and think my life is normal, like I'm really happy. Or I'm, how can you even stay in a place where your address has been leaked and even feel like you can go to sleep or feel relaxed? Can you, would you? I just need to know. It's not normal. I've been trying to be normal. I've been trying to deal with it. And you see the anger. This anger's not caused from anything apart from what I'm going through in my life, darling. Even to the case of going on holiday, they fucking troll me, they do this. All I want to do is make money, darling. It's my job. People enjoy watching me. They enjoy subscribing to me. They fucking enjoy gifting me. They, they love me. I'm going to reset.